There are new developments involving a young barber arrested for slashing the throat of a customer. Today, Daniel Flores answered to charges in court. 10 News reporter Steve Fiorina is live outside the barber shop where the slashing occurred. And Steve, a strange attack and still no idea why. Kim, it's something, a crime that calls to mind the old prohibition era gangsters like Al Capone and Frank Nitti. Navy man sitting in the chair here and his throat cut as he lay back for a shave. Daniel Flores leaned back in his chair, swiveling back and forth as he was arraigned on attempted murder charges before Judge Michael Wellington. He's accused in Monday's throat slashing at Vicks Barbershop in Imperial Beach, leaving a Navy medic critically injured. Tim Vaughn was getting a shave when attacked. That medic's cousin spoke to 10 News about the crime, ironically, a barber himself, one who does shaves with a straight razor. It's just unfathomable that somebody would actually do that to an individual, especially lying in a barber's chair. Flores had run from the scene and was arrested near the home of his aunt a mile and a half from here in the South San Diego neighborhood of Nestor. Formally charged now and pleading not guilty. The charges in this case include attempted murder with the allegations of great bodily injury as well as use of a weapon, a razor blade in this case. The maximum exposure is 13 years. There is no known motive and no indication it might be gang related. Flores' attorney asked that his client be housed in a more secure section of the county jail because of the notoriety of the case. I asked if there had been a threat. No indication of anything like that. I can't comment on, the, on why he wanted to do something like that. There is no bail. A preliminary hearing is scheduled late this month. And that may be when we learn why this happened. No one here is talking about this. The victim uh, last reported in critical condition. Live in Imperial Beach, Steve Fearman. All right.